This is going to be a mini general collective tarot reading if it's meant for you. It's meant for you. Okay, the current energy today is the death card. Death and rebirth, Scorpio energy, total transformation and change right now. Now the potential or challenge is the Queen of Pentacles. You're looking for more stability. So the potential here is going towards something more balanced, more stable. The challenge is achieving it. Now what should we focus on today? We have the Ten of Cups, happiness. Going towards your happiness and wish fulfillment. It's one thing to ask for happiness, another thing to allow it. Now your recent past, we have two cards. The Knight of Cups, oh, and the Queen of Swords. Somebody's had to make some boundaries in love. Okay, so if you wanna to go to the next level, you've gotta cut things out that no longer serve you. Now the strength position here is the Nine of Cups. Ask and you shall receive. This is personal wish fulfillment. What is it that you want? Who do you wanna be? Where do you wanna go? What do you wanna do? Now your near future, we have here the star. Healing, blessings, and even falling in love. Wishes coming true. Suggested approach, the Empress birthing a whole new cycle, being creative, doing what you're passionate about, divine feminine energy and receiving mode activated. Now, what do you need to know? Two cards, Queen of Cups, don't overgive, especially in love, but there's a very deep soul connection here. Now, the hope and or fear, Eight of Swords, overthinking, the illusion of mental entrapment and the probable outcome, the Ace of Cups, a brand new emotional beginning.